<laughs> oh my. Aren't you supposed to be in here? There's another priest on this side. Oh, look how cute he is. <laughs> Today is my last day in this apartment. Tomorrow I leave for Boston. When I come back, that day we leave for Cuenca and a couple other towns, and we're saying goodbye to Quito. I wouldn't say forever, but at least this apartment forever. Um, so today's moving day. I hate moving day. Packing day! I am the only one in this family who's really happy and positive on packing day. <laughs> I don't feel it that overwhelming. It definitely pales in comparison to packing, uh, let's see, 29 other times. You can in... pack for me, Jess. What? You can pack for me. No, I'm not packing your stuff. You're a pack rat. It's you on the long sleeve, yeah. right? That's, okay. That's okay. really long. Your travel shirt. Okay. This one we should probably... No, that one, that one watch. Bag number three. Now we're going to Largo School for a, uh, a last sort of weekend presentation. I think there's gonna be some singing. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Shut up. Knock him dead, Largo. Okay. We'll see you on stage. Sing your heart out. I love you. So that's what I'm trying to figure out. How can you... Okay, I see someone else. Do you want to film the school at all? Like the different buildings? Or... This is me filming the school. Oh, okay. All right. Hello, school. Uh... We're gonna miss you. This show's about to start. And trying to get it on the stage. This is Largo's yearbook, people. Yay! <laughs> and here's Largo. Our cutie patootie. Hi, Largo. Yeah. Oh, you're so cute. How about the, you and this one? No. Mom, look at me there. Mm -hmm. And I, I have jeans and an Adidas shirt on. without me for the next couple days. <laughs> Work on my Spanish and my boyfriend. <laughs> no, you're leaving me on moving week again. Again. This is my... I think it's planned. Every single, for the last couple moves, <laughs> I have been AWOL. He and conveniently has to go out of town. I need to call someone and find out if he's like, you really need me there, don't you? Please, you need me in Boston, don't you? Don't you? I, you don't have to pay me for know? the week. You don't have to pay me for the week. Just please get me out of this hell of How packing. How do you know I'm even going to Boston? That's a good point. <laughs> Done. 
You know you're cutting off half of my head. This is our stuff. This is what we own. This is what we still have to pack. This is what I'm taking back with me. And I am... I am ready to go back. I'm ready to, well, I guess I'm not ready. I don't want to go back. But I guess we're, we're packed and ready to go. For our last day here in Quito, we are now in the Old Town area. All right, here we go. And for my last selfish event, I'm getting a shave. So step one done, Largo. Haircut, success. Step two. Step two, the shave. It's hot. It's hot? He's hot. Oh, Jesus. <laughs> Does it smell funny? I love this guy. Do you feel like you could fall asleep right now? I want to take him home with me. I <laughs> know. <laughs> you think it's in my legs? <laughs> Will is never going to want to shave himself again. You're going to shave me like this from this now is a, on. This is a good angle. Maybe he could do the, the below the belt, too. <laughs> I uh, look so happy. I do like this. You're not gonna get this treatment in France, baby. I know, not for this price. Can I? How do you say "get his ear hair" in Spanish? <laughs> Yeah, I don't know if you can really tell the difference, but that was the best shave I've ever had so far here in Ecuador. And, and well, I guess the best shave I've had anywhere because this is the only place I've actually gotten shaves like this. So, once again, 10 bucks, shave and a haircut. And now I have silky smooth skin for my Come here, baby. sexy wife. <laughs> Hurry up, eat them all before the kids get some. This, this is tostado, which I've never seen anywhere but here. And it's delicious. I, they, may, they may exist in other countries, I have no idea. But these are like roasted corn, toasted, I guess. Not necessarily popcorn, because here it's not pop, but it's toasted, roasted corn. It's delicious. Hey, Dad? Loaded with salt, but it's delicious. Hey, Dad, mm. I've got a great idea. You find your drone here. I thought about that. What song is that, Largo? It's not a song. It's just pure music. So Jessica's trying to <coughs> ambitiously try native food. No, I had this before. I, I mean, I, you know. How would you give it out of ten? Um, Be honest. Um, well. My umita, which I love, I've always loved them, was a 10. It was very good. Um, <clears throat> the plantains with queso, no. I, you know, I don't know what it is, but I always, they're always so dry and not very sweet here. And they're just um, Come on. A two or three. There you two, go. three. <laughs> Let me do some And now I give it a hundred out of, out of 10. Wow. Is it the best ceviche you've ever had? And they really are all the same, so I can't judge. Bye.